happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. The doctor will tell you what is good for you. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. And if you're feeling poorly, just remember this tune. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Cause the doctor and nurse, well, they know what to do. They do. They'll always take good care of you. So be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. Be happy, be healthy, and get well soon. The doctor will tell you what is good for you. Be happy, be healthy, and... Get well soon. Hello, I'm Dr. Ange. Welcome to my surgery. Are you well? Yeah! Oh, good. Someone's not feeling well. I wonder who my next patient is. Who's come to visit me? Who will it be? Can you guess which friend it is? Let's see. It's. Joby! I've been playing football. I thought so. And you've got your arm. Yeah. How did you know? You've got your arm wrapped up in your football scarf. Oh, yeah. I was doing so well, Dr. Range. The ball comes my way, flying through the sky. I jump up. I flick my leg over my head. I kick the ball head over heels. Goal! <laughs> and then? Oh, I fell on my arm. It's so sore. Let's take a look. Mm. Oh dear, Joby, it's very swollen. Does it hurt? A bit. Ow! Ow! It hurts a lot, Dr. Rand. Oh, poor you. You might have broken your arm, Joby. Can you mend it for me? Yes, once we make sure it's broken, and that means a trip to the hospital. The hospital? Why, Dr. Rand? Can you mend it here? No, Joby. You need to go to the hospital because they've got a special machine there that takes a picture of your bones. I like having my picture taken. Cheese! Well, this machine takes a picture of the inside of you. No way! A picture of your bones. And that picture is called an X-ray. X-rays sound fantastic! Would you like to see some? You have some here? Yes. Come over to the light box. Ah, <laughs> oh, that looks like a hand. It is. Well, the inside of one. Cool! Look! You can see all the bones inside the hand. Cool! And what bone is that? That's the lower arm below the elbow, the same part as the one that I think you've broken. But there's two bones there. That's because there are two bones in the lower arm. This one's the radius. Radius! And this one is the ulna. Oh, that's easy to say. Ulna, ulna, ulna and radius. Hey, Dr. Ranch, guess what? What, Joby? I'm going to learn the names of all the bones in the body. Good luck, Joby. We've got 206 of them. No way. It is a lot. But guess what, Dr. Range? What, Joby? If I've got 206 bones and I've only broken one of them, then that means I've got... I've got... Um, I've got... 205? Yes, 205 bones that aren't broken. Oh, I think I'll be OK, Dr. Range. I'm off to play football again. Bye! Whoa! All our bones are important, Joby. We need to get them all mended. I don't even know why we have to have bones, Dr. Ranch. What are they for? Mm, that's a good question. Oh, oh, is it good enough to ask the healthy helpers? I'd say so. Let's have a chat with Nurse Morag. <laughs> Hello, Nurse Morag. Hey, Dr. Ranch. Who's with you today? I'm with Joby, and we think he might have broken his arm. Oh, poor you. Yes, but 205 of my bones are just fine. Oh, well, that's excellent. So what can I help you with today? No small rag, why do we have bones? Ah, now that's an excellent question. And I think we'll find the answer with the help of my healthy helpers. Ah! Catch that ball, yeah, it shall go. Give me questions, catch and through. Healthy helpers will show and tell. 
How you can keep fit and well Catch that ball, yeah, it's your goal Give me questions, catch them through Help the helpers, we'll show and tell How you can keep fit and well Ask me what you need to know Catch that ball, yeah, it's your goal Give me questions, catch them through Help the helpers, we'll show and tell How you can keep fit and well in Seven Oaks and my healthy helpers are... Hello, my name's Ashika and I like doing ballet with my sister. Hello, my name is Ryan and I like skiing and snow. Hi, my name is Jack and I like drawing squids. Hi, my name is Josephine and I like going to swim with my dad too. Now, why do we have bones? What a good question. What would it be like if we didn't have any bones? We'll be yes. flat, just like a puddle. We would. Do you think we'd be all wibbly wobbly? Let's see you all, kid on, you've got no bones. What would happen? We'd be like this. I think we'd all just fall down to the floor. <laughs> <laughs> right, guys, come and sit up in the cushions. Now, have any of you broken any bones like Joby? I broke my collarbone. You broke your collarbone. How did you manage that? Um, I fell out of my bed. And what did they do at the hospital? Um, I needed to get a sling on my arm. A sling? And how did they know? Was it a special picture they took? That's the X-ray. The X-ray? And that's when they take a special picture of your bones, isn't it? Oh, wow. So here we have... This is our collarbone. And see this wee bit here? Mm -hmm. That's the break. And Ryan, what about you? What happened to you? Um, I broke my arm. I fell on my arm on the toy box. So you went to the hospital and did they take a special picture of your arm? Did they yeah. take an x-ray? They uh, let me chose a blue um, plaster cast. Wow, because you can have a blue one or you can have a pink one or you can have an orange one. <laughs> but I have a white one to show you. And this is what it looks like. It's soft on the inside next to your skin and it's a bit harder on the outside to keep it nice and still. Pass it down, let everyone have a wee feel. <laughs> now, you guys have all been a bit unlucky with all your breaks and sprains, but I'm glad you're all better now. But shall we answer Joby's question about why we have bones by playing a game? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. OK, let's go then. Right, healthy helpers, take a seat. I am going to challenge you all to a quiz yeah. all about the body and its bones. Are you ready for the first question? Yeah. OK. The bones in our body protect our insides. Can you tell me what the large bone in our head ah. is called? Skull! That's right. 10 out of 10 is called a skull. And the skull protects our brains. And why do we need to protect our brains? Because we only have one brain. And it's very, very, <laughs> very important. Good answer, guys. Very... Question two, are you all ready? Yeah. OK. Bones come in all shapes and sizes. You've got straight ones, curvy ones, big ones and small ones. Where do you think the longest bone in our body is? I see lots of hands up. Ryan, you tell me the answer. Leg. Your leg, that's right. It's your thigh bone, which is called the femur. And it goes from here to here. Now for question three. Bones and joints, like our elbow joint and our knee joint, mean that we can move around easily and bend into different shapes. Can you tell me which parts of the body have the most bones in them? Your hands. That's right. Over Ow. half the bones in your body are in your hands and your feet. Isn't that amazing? Well done, guys. Now, we've only got one question left. Who has more bones in their necks? Giraffes or humans? The same, the same, the same. They are well done, the two of you. In fact, I think you all got that one straight away. Giraffes and humans have the same amount of bones in their neck. It's just that the giraffes are much, much, much bigger than ours. Isn't that interesting? Yeah. Right, guys, let's put the puzzle together. Go for it. Fantastic! And it's 
a human body. Great work, guys. I hope you found out a lot more about why we have bones. Get well soon, Joby! Bye! So, Joby's been at the hospital and it turns out he did break his arm. He had a crack in his radius. That's this bone here. I'm expecting him back any minute now. Dr Range! Dr Range! Look! I've got a plaster cast on my arm and guess what? What, JB? It's blue! My football colours! Nice! Yeah, it's a very special bandage. They made it specially for me. On the inside it's soft next to my skin, but on the outside it's really, really hard. Listen! Did you know why it's so hard, Dr Range? Well, to it's... keep my arm straight while it mends. It's amazing. The doctor says there's no way my arm can bend in this. Look, it's like armour. The doctor said my bones will grow back together and mend. Can you believe it? Well, I... And in three weeks' time, it'll be better and I can play football again. I'd give it a few more weeks once the plaster cast is off so that the bones can get stronger. You don't want to break it again, do you? No. But guess what, Dr Range? What, Jebby? I can watch football! Of course you can! Goal! OK, Dr Range, let's sing about it. Hooray for x-rays! Mm -hmm. Those clever x-rays! Uh -huh. There's so much that they can help us all to see. All to see! With all the problems out of view, they can help us care for you. We'll mend that broken bone so carefully. I hope so. So always have a care, uh -huh. don't slip down on the stair I won't don't trip and tumble headlong from a tree Oh no! But if your poor arm takes a while Then your bone might have a crack It has! X-rays can look inside and see Woohoo! Hooray for X-rays! Those clever X-rays There's so much that they can help us all to see Know the problems out of view They can help us care for you You win that broken bone so carefully if you've an achy, breaky arm, there's no need to be alarmed. I won't. The doctor is such a helpful friend. Oh, good. With your arm wrapped in a cast, mm -hmm. that aching just can't last. Mm -hmm. We'll be sure to mend it in the end. Thanks, Dr. Range. Hooray for x-rays. Those clever x-rays. There's so much that they can help us all to see. All the problems out of view, they can help us care for you. We'll mend that broken bone so carefully. Hooray for x-rays. Those clever x-rays, there's so much that they can help us all to see. And all the problems out of view, they can help us care for you. We'll mend that broken bone so carefully. We'll mend that broken bone so carefully. We'll mend that broken bone so carefully. Look, Dr. Rand, the doctor at the hospital drew a picture of a footballer on my plaster cast. Excellent! Would you like to draw a picture, Dr. Rand? I'm not very good at drawing. Really? But guess what I am good at, JB? What? This! Wow! A balloon footballer! I love it! For now, just let balloon footballer do all the kicking. Keep your plaster cast nice and dry, and in two or three weeks, we'll take the cast off. I will, Dr. Rand. Oh, there you go. Oh, thanks, Dr. Rand. Bye! Bye, JB. He shoots! He scores! <laughs> Joby's lively, isn't he? Even when he's not too well. It's so peaceful and quiet now he's gone. Go! Maybe not. Bye, everyone. And remember, be happy, be healthy. If you're not feeling well, it's always best to go and see your own doctor and get well soon.